Oh uh, no, he's not wearing a bone skirt. Although, if this is more or less stupid, it's up to you. But those, th those bones aren't covered on his height. Speaking of Skeletor... <laughs> yeah, this kind of looks like him, except this guy's wearing more armor. Mm. By the way, that tells me... He wasn't wearing any armor at all. No, but, but he did rock that leotard. By the way, I have to mention, I sort of like his helmet with the exception of the spikes. It looks like a mix between a Conquistador's helmet and that uh, Babuta type helmet that I think is Italian in origin. This fearsome warrior holds you with his glowing eyes, and you feel waves of powerful psychic energy buffet your mind. Your advanced Kai defense repel this attack, but you are left no doubt that he is deeply jealous of your supposed defeat of Lone Wolf. Nor moves from the dais and commands Kekotuk, Kekotuk to uh, cease his psychic assault. The murderous Leviathan complies at once with his fell master's wishes. For the first time since he strode into this throne hall, Kekotuk turns to face Nor. His intent is to bow his huge form in dutiful deference to his master's authority, but this formality is soon forgotten when his psychic powers detect the presence of Alice. The realization that she is here makes the warrior bellow with supernatural rage. The deafening sound galvanizes Alice into action and she leaps towards the plinth and places both of her hands upon the surface of the moonstone. Instantly, a whirling hole appears in the smoky wall of the throne hall. It is the unmistakable mouth of a shadow gate. Flee, lone wolf, she cries. Flee to your homeland before it's too late! Bravely, she stands her ground, her hands clasped upon the glowing moonstone as Kekotuk and Gnaw advances upon her from two sides. You are deeply moved by the courage of this enigmatic being. It seems she is prepared to sacrifice her immortality that you might escape alive from this terrible place. Do you wish to obey her command and enter the Shadow Shadowgate, or would you rather stay here and fight the Dark God and his evil Avenger? Okay, I need to be honest. I would say I'm torn between this, but if we run now, they're just going to come back stronger and more pissed off than ever. Oh, and they will probably also have absorbed her power, which means that we will be stronger for it. Okay, I've seen this episode of Spider-Man. The one where he works together with Doctor Strange. You don't fight an all-powerful enemy in his own di in his own dimension. I agree, and also, very importantly, this is the second last book. We are not going to get to defeat him now. I suppose you're right. Sorry, but my whole the, yeah. the only thing we can uh, we can achieve by that is to, you know um, to get both of us killed. Yeah, I suppose. Also, I think this is the reason why I think I would fail epically in a real-life RPG. I think I would just be standing back there wanting to kill every single motherfucker that ever wronged me. And my vendetta that would be as long as something very long. Um, Brian, you have been playing real-life RPGs, and you haven't been failing epically. At least not more than the rest of us. Oh yeah, but I mean, you know, real life, you know, arm and all that, and go out and play a role and all that. You oh. all, but haven't you also Larving. done that? Larving, yeah. But you also LARPed, and though I don't know if you failed epically at that. I wasn't there. <laughs> I did. I don't think he, he failed epically if he actually had to be lone wolf. Oh. So do I, because we wouldn't judge everyone want to be ugly. Indeed. In any case, you choose to flee. Uh, yeah, that is a greater wisdom here, so uh, we shall bravely uh, flee through the portal. I mean, uh, we, we learned our lesson with the damn merchant. I don't think Lone Wolf have yet. <laughs> Desperately, you scramble across the throne hall and leap towards the swirling maw of this supernatural portal, but your entry is barred by a horde of shrieking horrors which materialize from the smoke surrounding the circumference of the Shadow Gate. Immediately, you recognize them and your heart sinks. They are crypt spawn. Now Nor himself is aware of your true identity, and he is determined not to let you escape from the plane of darkness. You draw your divine blade from its scabbard, and a halo of golden light irradi irradiates the throne hall. Nor bellows with a terrible rage. He is mortally aghast that such a holy weapon should be unsheathed in his inner sanctum, and in his rage he summons yet a further horde of Cryptspawn to attack and overwhelm you. Sound like they have anything better to do. Right, you're now finding a crypt spawn horde. You know what I'm saying? What's your combat skill? Let us have a look. I think you have a little bit of that. I th yeah, I think it's uh, 53. 
Right, and you get to add four, uh, four to it for this combat only because it is the antithesis of everything this dimension stands for. So that would be 57? Yeah, 57. Right, okay. Give it here. Rove and I. Eight. Right, you leap into action and tear into the hole before you. Carve them like weave before the scythe. Fell them left and right. Alright, as your divine blade pulverizes them, as you make your desperate attempt to get to that gate. Rove it uh, again. Well, hello, Samurai Jack. Hi. Right. Rotten tentacles stretch out and lash onto you, draining of your energy, but you carve them off and cut them open and slash them and stab them and hack, 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 hack. You lose two endurance points. Uh, Look at me, I'm, I'm a hacker! <laughs> What was it again? Hacks. I call hacks. <laughs> oh, I was about to use that one here in here. Jesus. I have no jokes left. A shame. You should have just said it instead of giving the word to her. <laughs> anyway, nine. Yeah, you go stab slash hacks, stab, whirl, twirl, death, doom, murder, slap, stash. You murdered that, killed them. Lone yeah. Wolf is one of the most deadly ballerinas ever. <laughs> Rover die again. One? Right. The horn pounces you from all sides. It's like a tiny wave of rotting flying brains that really hate you. Which is an uncomfortable experience to say the least. Oh god, it's the collected minds of the internet! You lose five endurance points as you almost drown in rotten cerebral matter. Nonetheless, in vi since they're so close, you have plenty of opportunity to stab them a lot. Oh my god, Super Mega Death Christ! Well, then let's that do that. Nine. And with a final swing of your sword, a radiant wave erupts from you and sends the rotten horse flying in all directions, smoking and, in and turning to ash. You have won. As the last of the creatures die, you leap over its he heaped body and stumble through the shadow gate into a whirling oblivion. The last image that burns into the, your memory is that of Alice slowly succumbing to the relentless blows from Kekatuk's axe. The memory of her fearless bravery strengthens your spirit and resolves to forever serve the forces of good against the accursed hordes of darkness. Congratulations, Grandmaster! You have won a great victory over the forces of evil. You have defeated Norse sinister plan to destroy you and conquer all of Magnemon. But as you return through the Shadow Gate to the land of your birth, you know that the fight against evil to the land... No, sorry, skip the line. You know that the fight against evil is not yet over. If you are to prevent the Dark God from launching his armies of night into Magnemon, you must return to the Plane of Darkness and retrieve the fabled Moonstone. Only by doing so will Magnemon be safe from the ravages of Norse unholy hordes. It will be a supreme perilous mission, perhaps the most dangerous you have ever undertaken. If you possess the true courage of a kind Grandmaster, the ultimate quest awaits you in the climax to the Grandmaster series. So yeah, next book is about getting back to that stone you just left. Huh. I see. We just got out, now we have to go back in. Yep. Wonderful! But since it's a new book, you'll do so with one more skill and a few points extra. I guess that'll make a difference. Maybe. Too bad that the realm of Ultimate Evil is not like a swing door that you just walk through whenever you damn well please. Why yeah. does not just walk into Mordor? Exactly. Yep. In any case, that was Lone Wolf, Wolf Spain. What did you all think? It was basically one giant chase scene. Yeah. Yeah, I see. <laughs> With a sudden dose of cyberpunk that really came out of nowhere. Yeah. Although I really like that, like that uh, Kaker took the Avenger guy. And yeah, he was. Although we didn't get to fight him, he's so awesome. Maybe, maybe we'll get to fight him next time. Mm. Perhaps also the girl who, who made an incredible sacrifice. However, I'm a little worried about what exactly is going to happen to her. By the way, the whole thing with controlling time. And, and the space. moment we were out of the way, she just froze time and went off to do her own thing. That would be awesome if not for the fact that we uh, got some word that she was coming to the fact that the guy was asking her a few questions. Mm. But yeah, at least Kekatuk looked like a dignified, although still quite exaggerated, evil guy. Unlike North, who just looked like silly putty. Yeah, like I said, he kind of looks like uh, Tetsuo uh, 
from Akira, you know, in the end of the movie where he completely loses it and then completely... Yeah. Yeah, I have not seen that, but I will take your word for it. I mean, the worst thing is that Nor can apparently take whatever form he wishes, and he takes that. I mean, wow. I could at least understand why some of those things created by those evil druids look completely fucked up, because, you know, mixing genes like that's bound to create some crazy things, but Nor was just... Yeah, a bit... Yeah. Anyway, so I've also written down that the Moonstone of the Shianti is the most legendary artifact in the history of Moon. We have never heard about... We have never heard of it before. It was busy being legendary everywhere else. Yeah. It's just sort of like the books ran out of ideas here. here and, and now they're sort of thinking, okay, what would be cool to let them run into? Yeah. And then they decide on and a that's cyberpunk really not thing a way instead. to write a story. I'm sorry, it's not. Lone Wolf encounters random stuff. And it had just gone from, what is it, quasi-fantasy into cyberpunk, apparently. Yeah, but it's not always cyberpunk. I mean, first of all, like, you're chasing your evil doppel in a catacomb, in a deep catacomb. Okay, fair enough. Then it's suddenly, you are now fighting uh, your evil clone... In fantasy Vietnam on another planet. Okay, I guess that's fine. You're now fi chasing a clone in Shadowrun Lone Wolf. Wait, what? You're now in a flying castle! Wait, what have you? in the evil dimension! What the? Watch out for the silly pretty guy! Wait, what? The laser and moonstone! Hold on, could you just. You are returned to your home dimension! You won! What? In essence, things. Have changed a bit much. These this this book needs Ritalin. In essence, wait, what? New and what? What? <laughs> New and what? Yeah. <laughs> that but about yeah. sums it up. I suppose. But at least we got rid of that bastard who happened to be a evil clone, blah, 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 and we skewered his heart, so I'm very satisfied. Oh, I completely forgot the... You're no lone wolf in Honey, I Shrunk the Kylord! And you're still chasing your evil double! I completely forgot about that part. Well, think about this way, at least we got a monkey out of it. Yay, monkey! Yeah, now our... Now our fantastic grill bar and, and mini so have a... Mascot, that's something. Yes. This thing is turning a little insane for me. Yeah. But, I guess we'll see what happens in the next book. In the, you know, final one. Mm -hmm. I suppose. So, this has been Eric Cobra. And Ron and Araja. And Warlord Wine. And Givenia. And join us next time when the Breezies arrive. Yay, no Breezies! <laughs> oh, no, no, no! Don't go there! See y'all around, people. See ya! See ya! Bye-bye.